What's up guys, Inigami here, and let's go through 40 Stamina Valentine's Day Chopper on the Japanese version of One Piece Trailer Cruise. Chopper is a int character. The mini boss on stage 5 is gonna be Kikyo, Khalifa, or Dr. Kureha. They each do something different. We're gonna get right into it. So, we're gonna be using a slasher team, a Mihawk Zoro slasher team. You can use double dex Mihawk, you can use... Uh, Dex Mihawk Law or something like that. I would not really recommend the Int Mihawk because we want to burst him down, uh, avoid his 30% because below 30% he'll get a damage reducing barrier. So I'm using a 6 star Zoro friend for his type boosting ability Mihawk. We we're going to be bringing Dex General Zombie and the reason we have the Dex General Zombie is because Chopper will preemptively lower our attack by half and our recovery by half for four turns. So we use Dex General Zombie. We can use that on stage six and ignore that and have our full regular attack damage. And Chopper has about 1.5 to 2 million hit points. Depending on if you get Chopper by himself or Chopper with a bunch of dudes around him. We're also gonna put our other potential slasher captains in the bottom row because if you get Khalifa as your mini boss. Khalifa is going to swap your captain with one of your bottom row captains. So that's why we have Killer and Dopey in the bottom row because they are both uh, slasher leads. The secret stage for this island is going to be either a... either Mansherry, who will show up, heal your team, and kill herself, or you can get um, a bunch of rainbow units. Rainbow units will be the rainbow armored crab, rainbow regular crab, uh, that's ar armored spiral penguin and pirate penguin. Any of those guys do drop. Those can show up on any stage, it's not the boss stage. So with the mini bosses, Kikyo is probably the hardest. She will give you all badly matching block and recovery orbs. After that, she will, uh, on her turn three, enrage which will make her entire team have a one turn attack timer and also attack every single turn for 1.5 times their regular attack. But if you use your Gomhan Usopp after she enrages and you're good to go, it's just that on that stage, you want to make sure you take all the guys around her down without leaving them below 50% health. And Kikyo has a bunch of red characters on her team too, and that makes it a little bit hard for a lot of teams. If you have Khalifa, Khalifa will swap your captain with a random bottom row captain. So that's why we're putting, once again, our Killer and our Dopey in the bottom rows. And if you get Kureha, Kureha will bind the bottom right hand corner character for 10 turns. But we're going to go and pop Usopp our way through either one of those, whichever one we get. Oh, we'll kill that. So which one we get? Oh, we got Kikyo, of course we got Kikyo. Should give us those badly matching recovery orbs. And I am going to. I'm gonna go down Usopp and then we're gonna focus on the Kikyo. So Kikyo has about 560,000 hit points. She doesn't do anything based off of her health. But if we take her down, then she will not enrage. Also, don't forget with our Zoro friend captain that we get more attack if we kill something on the last turn. I'll take Kikyo down. She, she'll fold. Oh, I almost thought you were a good attacker. You bad. So now that Kikyo's down, we can take everyone else down at our leisure. Focusing on these girls, getting her down ASAP. Trying not to leave them below 50% health. And we'll leave, try to leave the blue girl last. I keep looking at that green orb on the Dex General Zombie as if you actually have attacked Dex General Zombie, but you don't. Don't lie to me. And with these girls, we can take our time. Once again, just avoiding getting them below half health. Chopper has a special interrupt, so if you use a special that will delay, she will in response. Chopper will in response. Not she. I'm still thinking of these girls. Chopper will in response to you delaying him. Will heal back to full everyone on his side and also despair both of your captains for ten turns. Now, if you want to use a double ray boss Blackbeard team, it could work. But remember with double ray boss Blackbeard that if you get Khalifa, 
she will swap your captains with one of the bottom rows, which means you'll lose like all your health. Oh, left him alive. No. It's okay. It's all good, man. It's all good in the hood. Oh, auto tar oh, good. auto targets, auto targets. What are you doing? Don't trust auto target. Don't trust their lies. So there is no preemptive shuffle. So whatever dex orbs we get, we get to keep. Chopper will either be by himself or with three guys. Oh, we got Chopper by himself. Chopper by himself has about two million hit points. I didn't even use you. What am I doing? Being a being a noob. <laughs> being a noob. So the reason we brought you is so that way we could lower his attack. I mean, so we could ignore the attack down. Do that, and you'll do twice as much damage as I'm about to deal on this turn. That's a uh, that's a uh, that's pro strats. Pro strats. Killer just for the health cut, and I will burst this turn. Oh, chopper, you live! Chopper is going to get his damage reduction. Chopper still is only going to attack for 10,000 damage, so we're going to survive. But now we have to deal with the damage reduction, percent damage reduction for three turns. Which is super whenever our attack is lower. Let's keep, let's keep punching me, fam. Let's keep punching me, fam. As soon as your damage reduction is gone, we'll have a better time. My, my half damage will be gone. Uh, just don't... Don't be a noob. Uh, the professional strategy is don't be a noob and actually use the characters that you bring for the purpose you brought them for. It's gonna keep healing. I'm gonna keep punching. I'm gonna look for dex orbs. So this percent damage reduction will be gone. Our attack will go back to normal. We got two turns to kill him. Thanks, Chopper. So yeah, you remember to use a green general zombie on stage 6 before you get into Chopper. Not after you get into Chopper. There's a reason I brought him. There's a whole reason I brought him is to do that. You could have just burst him in a single turn. That would have been the smart thing to do. But I have been kicking it to the curb. Like a, like a pro. So what does Chopper actually do, right? So after that amazing, amazing showing, um, amazing, amazing, amazing run. Look at Chopper. So Chopper is an int powerhouse shooter. Once evolved, his max attack goes to right about a thousand. His captain ability boosts the attack and recovery of all characters 1.25 times and prevents death as long as you're above a certain percent. We haven't exactly tested how much that is yet, but remember it doesn't work. Um, if you take multiple hits, it's just like Coliseum Kobe. All right, not uh, he's a zombie captain. Zombie captain, sorry. So his special ability though heals six times your recover his recovery and hit points. Not that useful. Not that important. It does heal a little bit. Max recovery is three hundred, so you get a heal for about eighteen hundred health. But more importantly, his special ability reduces paralysis duration by three turns. So that's going to be pretty useful. Three turn paralysis reduction on a seven turn cooldown once you max him out. Guys, pretty good. I've been Zinigami. Thank you so much for watching. Good luck with Chopper. You only got one week to get him. Y'all stay beautiful.